welcome to me reacting to Homecoming, Scott the Waz by Scott the Waz. Now, I have not seen this, and I think this is on Homecoming, is it the Homecoming, you know how like people have Homecoming dances? Is, is that what this is on about? Because if it is, then personally, Homecoming dance was pretty boring. <laughs> it was actually pretty boring, in my opinion. But, uh, yeah, anyways, guys, originally in the description, make sure to Scott the Wazing. So, in the description, always, let's get right into it. Hey, all Scott here, and tonight's the big homecoming dance. Not it, yeah, I was right. Anything, but I'm gonna get right. laid. Hey, all Scott no, here, and tonight was the big night seven years ago. Not to brag or anything, <laughs> but I wish I got laid. Yeah, I know what time of year it is. I've been to Target. Back to school season is in full swing, as in it's no longer oh. back to school, it's just school. That means school yeah, dances true. are back, everybody. A collaboration between between pop music or Ooh, this was a year ago this yeah this was a year ago so uh <laughs> yeah school dances aren't a thing which honestly personally looking back at school dances they were they were okay sometimes they were fun and sometimes they were really boring so you know y you were kind of getting a 50 50 of is this going to be really fun or is this just going to be really you know, just boring. Hormones and wasting money. The school dance is defined as the concept of dimming the lights in a school gym, hiring an underpaid DJ to play Dear God anything below by Flo Rida, and forcing children to show up to a school at night and sweat for three hours. You'd reach for your nearest yeah, fancy sweat. fitting dress shirt, pay ten whole dollars to stand in the school auditorium on the weekend, and assume that this was it. This was the night you totally experienced what it's like to score. And then you realized, oh yeah, I'm 15. I'll just stand and do nothing for most of the dance. <laughs> <laughs> He's so and right. Like, I mean, sweaty. School dances started for me. Oh yeah. Middle no, it was horrible. Be before it was like too hot. And were labeled as casual dances. There are many looks I would go for with these dances, usually striking a balance between wearing a polo and jeans and pure fear. Before oh yeah. Well, I wasn't expecting the world from these, but when high I had school came into these. the picture and dress shirts were involved, oh shit, it's happening. A few school dances were held throughout the year, but the first big one was the homecoming dance. And this Oh, yeah. It. Homecoming week, there'd be the big school football game, a pep rally during classes, which, yeah, okay, education's tossed to the side. Hey, the oh, yeah, I've had, had, I've had one of those. The pep rally was actually pretty good. And then the Saturday night of that week, the big dance would be held, and... <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> no, so right, you. though. You see, I prefer... You do just stand there and dance. It's, it's, it's yeah. taking freshmen. What the hell was going on there? You see, a big part of homecoming Wait. was asking somebody on a date. All you had to do was grab a poster board, think of some pun, and ask him out. It was all about flashiness over function with those things. As long as you were memorable and had a pun involved. <laughs> I personally am not True. Really thrilled with how I spent homecoming. I felt like I was supposed to be getting a kiss or a gift card or something. I felt like I wasn't doing what I was supposed to be doing. Instead, I usually went home early and just started to count how many copies of Premium Rush that I owned. That's what? why I want to throw my own homecoming dance. One that doesn't have the pressure of trying to get laid. One that's open to everybody. Oh. Pretty nice venue, right? Scored on a Labor Day sale. 14 grand instead of 15. My goal is to make the greatest homecoming dance ever with just as much no sex as I remember, but I can't do it all myself, which is why we hired a professional planner. Sir, you won't regret your choice. With me, oh, so this is like a plot. A great homecoming dance doesn't require just blood, <laughs> sweat, and tears. Just sweat and tears. That's why I'm going to great lengths to ensure this is going to be the greatest one ever. I turned my car into a walking advertisement for the dance, and I put in place- Oh, he's, gonna, he's gonna crash! He's gonna crash! There's a strict no-skin policy. If it ain't covered up, it's getting thrown out. If you don't abide by this policy, you must have flashlight taped to crotch. Yes, I spelled that right. This is to ensure things don't get too PG when the lights dim. And if things get out of hand, that's where our trusty chaperone enters the picture. He's been violently what? conditioned to resist all forms of <laughs> violence, violence, and sex, and most importantly, sex. You sure you don't want to I'm really good at funerals. If I'm free next week, sure, but right now I want a school dance. All right, well, I did some research, made a few calls, so I can officially say I'm legally able to plan school dances now. Oh, legal, yes! It really wasn't that difficult. A lot of my training carried over. It was over a funeral school plan. Dances, tomato, tomato. So what's the plan here? I was thinking we could do some fun activities, like we could stand up against the wall and just wait for somebody to talk to us. But why do so many people like school dances? The way I see it, you can't spell homecoming without alcohol poisoning. No! What? I just wanted a school dance where nobody got laid. Now that everyone's actively endorsing what? everything laid related, everybody's gonna get what? laid. We got our new ads in. Since many high schoolers take homecoming as an excuse to get sloshed with their friends before and after the dance, this will be the first alcohol endorsed school dance. One where you don't have to worry about the chaperone narking on your addiction. So now we're deliberately spiking everything. We're spiking the punch, the food, the ballot box. 
Please don't tell Don't me. actually oh, what? DJ we got. DJ Abstinence, DJ for school kids. Nah, Scal Blasniak, DJ Abstinence Greeter. You will not be disappointed in my services. I made the best playlist for kids that are half my age. It's all here on my trusty laptop. <laughs> I thought that was a beer. You just don't get it. They're just kids. They're, they're big nights. They're homecoming dance. I'll never hurt anyone. Well, the chaperone is getting psychologically conditioned to be all for alcohol, drugs, violence, sex, and most importantly, sex. All right, we got the Wait, DJ. What? The advertisements are out. Chaperone is being conditioned to be actively encouraging immorality. A ballot box has been spiked. All right, all that's left is the banner. We used a pre-made restaurant template. All right, it's time for <laughs> to come. Let's open up the doors for business tonight. Hey, welcome to homecoming. Uh, before you go, just to let you know, you can get, uh, as some will put it, drunk. I'm a little worried about the alcohol <laughs> endorsement. <laughs> this is like, so funny. Want. Hey man, I love the life. sketch. How about a Bible around here I could read? This is a fucking disaster. I didn't want to push for sending, and now that I am, and we got the chaperone pushing for it, people don't care. No! Oh. Sorry, man. I thought that wasn't a beer. Man, yeah, we were pre game at the homeless shelter. I thought that wasn't. It was great. Hey, guys, condoms, right? Why aren't you f it? You apparently can't push for <laughs> have a good time, and since. Sorry, I'm so sorry, but this is just so... <laughs> this is so... <laughs> oh, that was so funny. That was so funny, though. The way <laughs> the way he delivered that line. The way he just screamed. <laughs> oh, that was... That was funny. Oh, I'm, I'm tearing up. Oh my god, that was hilarious. Honestly, this is so good so far. The humor is on point. The writing is good. The, the jokes are good. I love that it's like, at first it was like, oh, you know, not, no, blah, blah, and none of this, none of this. And then, like, they switch to that. And then the, I love that you have the guy, <laughs> you have the guy, you have the freaking officer guy saying, like, sorry, I thought that was a beer. And then he goes to, sorry, I thought that wasn't a beer. <laughs> it's so funny. It's so funny. <laughs> Like, why are you? Yeah, like <laughs> this is so funny. The plot, the plot of the sketch is so brilliant. It is so good, so well written. Honestly, I'm loving it. It's so awesome. I'm known as the resident beer pusher at this dance. I need to hide my identity with a mask so then people can be relaxed. Oh, <laughs> this will ease the tension. Oh, damn it. Why did you do that? So then people are too distracted by the punch stain to realize it looks like I pissed myself. Hey Scott, the coffin just came. Where do you want it? Oh, God, I already told you, this is a no coffin dance! Hey, I'm just throwing it out there. I called the police to ask them if it was illegal to give beer to kids without asking for their IDs. They're gonna be out here in about 10 minutes. Oh! All right, homecoming's over. Take your goodie bags. This is just a Take copy your... of Premium Rush. Get out. <laughs> well. I got questioned by the police, I yelled at everybody, uh, beer was everywhere, I got home at 4 a.m., and I got f***ing soaked. It was the homecoming I always wanted in high school! <laughs> <laughs> True. Honestly, that just sounds better, though, to be honest. Homecoming is... Homecoming? Yeah. No. It kind of sucks, honestly. The school dances are... Yeah. Eh. I don't know. But this was so funny. Honestly... That ending was really good. I like that ending. That was a pretty good ending. Honestly, this was such a good sketch. I love the idea behind it. It it was really clever. It was really funny. The jokes were on point. They like it, it was hilarious. It was honestly really funny. But uh, yeah, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the Black New Year's comment. I'll see you next one. Bye. Yeah.